what's up everyone it's Tin here welcome to another video comparison now today we're going to compare grok 3 versus quen 2.5 max so let's just switch to max uh, we're going to be comparing those uh, with coding so i have a couple of uh, prompts here in chat gpt below uh, that you don't see right now and yeah we can kind of get started here so um, as you can see, the first is click the button game. So we're going to go in Grok, create a simple game where a button appears at random positions and the player clicks it to score points. Make sure it's it's in HTML, CSS and JavaScript. And let's just copy that here. So uh, here, by the way, you can use, I think this one. Yeah, this is actually, I think the where you can actually run the code inside um, inside the Grok or uh, inside a Gwen. So let's just send this. Let's just send this as well. Obviously, we, we cannot see it yet. So let's see. So Grok is immediately writing, or it's actually done. So let's just copy this. We go to HTML online editor. Just make sure we delete this. Let's test out Grok. So this is this is Grok, right? Now we're going to test out uh, Quen. Quen is actually still going. It's still generating 80 lines of code. This was done in less than 80 lines of code, which I'm aware, yeah. So as you can see, it's actually still going. So Quen is a little bit slower, but as you can see, the user interface looks better. It doesn't have the, so it doesn't have the, let's run again. It doesn't have the line, the stroke, but overall it looks good. Also the UI looks better, yeah. So Quen kinda looks better in my opinion here, uh, but okay, let's go to the next one. So let's go here. By the way, yeah, this is called artifacts for those of you who don't know. So let's go and let's build rock, paper, scissors in HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. So let's do that one. So let's let's hit it off. Let's hit it off here. As you can see, usually Grok is a little bit faster, in my opinion. Um, not in my opinion, you can cl clearly see it, right? However, as you can see, sometimes it lags, I don't know why, uh, but as you can see, Grok is done, and right now the Quen will also be done soon. So let's copy Grok here, and let's paste it here. As you can see, we have Rock. Okay, we also have sound effects, which is really great. Um, now let's see what... Uh, Quen will do. So Quen usually takes a bit more time. I'm not sure why. Um, so actually this is not it, right? So Quen didn't actually went in. Okay, it, it went in, sorry. So by the way, yeah, the UI looks better on Quen. However, for most basic games like these ones, I can see that they are copying the same UI. So um, yeah, as you can see, you choose paper, it's a tie, okay. So it doesn't have any sound effects. With Grok, you have sound effects and it's much faster. So uh, yeah, that's what that's what I kind of get from it. So uh, by the way, these prompts are going from the most easiest one to the most difficult one. So uh, let's see how we can actually keep up. So this is the difficult one, right? So a, a more difficult one in HTML, CSS, and JavaScript. So let's copy this, let's copy this. Let's hit it off here. Let's hit it off here. So let's actually see what will happen here. Um, again, I noticed that Quen is using more, uh, it's using more code. I don't know why. Uh, Grok it is, doesn't use more code. So I think Grok is much better at uh, just using less code and making the same output, right? So let's do, do it here. Again, Grok is again faster here. Let's paste it, let's run it. As you can see, this is it, right? So this is the game. 
we also have easy we have medium and we have hard so okay so this overall looks good the ui doesn't look that good so keep in mind this is i think this is less than 100 lines of code probably 100 no less than 100 and this is 243 lines of code so let's see uh artifacts okay so this actually looks much better than uh grox so it looks much better right um as you can see okay yeah and then you have rank moves time you have leaderboard as well as well so yeah honestly it looks better than grok even though grok was faster um again it really depends for what you want to use grok and for what you want to use quinn so okay let's go to the fourth one we have after fourth one we have one more so this is a snake game classical I always uh, put this just so we make sure it's in this in this uh, language so okay let's put it here to the test again Quinn sometimes lags as well I'm not sure why that happens um, but as you can see again Grok is done here uh, as you can see run smoothly okay so Grok is done here again under 100 lines of code I would say for most of these games so as you can see this is the game right typical snake game guys so while we're waiting for Quen <laughs> we're, we're playing the snake game so okay so very basic let's see what Quen will do again over 200 lines of code and this is typical for Gwen, Quen and this is typical for uh, for uh, Grok so let's click artifacts here so as you can see it doesn't actually work okay so I actually need to add the arrow keys here Honestly, this looks kind of odd, to be honest with you. But honestly, I would say Grok, Grok's game looks better. So so yeah, that's the snake game, guys. Um, let's do... Uh, so I would say, again, Grok here a bit better, but because it's much faster. Uh, but again, let's go to the next one, which is a platformer game. So this is the, the new... So let's copy this here let's hit it off and let's hit it off here as well so again uh, what I noticed is Quen is a bit slower uh, it does uh, write more code than Grok Grok is faster and it writes less code than Quen and uh, overall I would say Grok is much more efficient if you want to use it for coding purposes I didn't yet test it out for other uh, languages like TypeScript or maybe Java or maybe like C plus C sharp right however you can as you can see so this is the so how do I play it let me actually go here how do I play it okay so we have gravity jump player falls with gravity jumps with space bar okay Okay, so I cannot actually I cannot actually play it. You see how it lags? Uh, can you fix it? Because I cannot play it. It immediately ends the game. So that's like the first issue. Let's go to the artifacts here. Again, the same issue, right? Obviously. Or I don't know how to play this game guys so I don't know what it is but as you can see the way how the game looks like UI is always the same like the the font and everything uh, let's see what this uh, grok actually came up with here okay I need to actually refresh this guys so that I can finally go into let me actually go HTML Let's put it here. Let's do this one and let's do this one, guys. So, okay, so now it actually, yeah. So I need to actually jump with spacebar, but I, I cannot actually enter the game. Okay, however, if you see, there's more details in Quen. Uh, so I would say Quen is more detailed one, Grok is more efficient one and much faster one. So I guess right now you kind of saw 
um, you know, comparison between these two in terms of this um, gaming and HTML coding stuff. So yeah, um, I would love to see what you guys think in the comments below. And uh, yeah, this was the, the uh, you know, Grok versus Quen battle. Um, but I will do more of these videos in the future. Thank you guys for watching.